So we're sat in the same place as where we did this trivia in Fathoms and there's a massive queue of people waiting to get the cards. Six chances per game, $25, 12 chances, $40, one chance, $10, add on six chances for the fourth game. Six paper cards, $40, six paper cards, $25 or a single pack for $10. This is where we did this trivia about half an hour ago. So it's got a lot busier. The place is almost full. Seems like everybody wants to do bingo today. So this section right here of the room, do we all have bingo cards? Well, one person in the party is in the line already if you do not have them with you. One person in the line and over here as well. Yes, marvellous. Tommy. Tommy. Hey Tommy. Someone's lost a card. Is that you? There you go, Tommy. Oh, Alright, this next section of the room right over here. Do we all Ooh. have bingo cards? Or yep. someone in the line who is about to get them? We've got yes. our bingo cards. Marvellous. We've got our bingo cards. Uh, can we like... And our section over this side. Yeah, just move them, it's fine. We've all got bingo cards ready. All We're someone all drinking. in the line about to purchase them. Yes, marvellous. Thank you for the pens. It's really busy. They're stopping people from coming in. It's that busy. What do you say? It says they're doing it again tomorrow. We've got cards. Who's got cards? Yeah, don't even ask how much it was. I've seen on board. Daisy and Donald have come out to see us in the atrium area. I'm going to say hello to everyone. All the princess is coming downstairs. And all the princess is going to Lumiere's. Bye bye princesses. It's absolutely beautiful day today. This is the atrium and all these massive portals all the way down. And you got Lumiere's to the left here. And they're playing trivia up there at the minute. I didn't realise there were two trivias on today. Yeah, we are going a bit faster <laughs> now. It's a bit hard to wear uh, talk when we've got the mask on. Ellie's not got her mask on though, you should be wearing your mask. So we didn't pay our tips up front, so uh, we just headed to guest services because we're just checking as uh, my Disney account on the Navigator to tell us how much we'd spent and stuff. And um, it's already taken the gratitudes, and they do that each day after each meal. So um, just be aware if you do come on this cruise over the next couple of months that if you haven't paid your gratitudes, that's your uh, tips to your servers they will take those at the end of each day of your trip the guys are still up there uh, Lucy had a picture with them so it is quite expensive on the ship as well um, we just went and played bingo and had drinks and it cost us $76 in total and that's just getting one drink each four of us and uh, $50 for bingo tickets so congratulations to the pers uh, the two people that won twice um, and came out with $700 so the time is quarter past four now so I think we're just gonna take a walk around and see what's on offer because um, obviously we have to go back to cabin a bit later on to get changed for uh, Rapunzel 
lunch tonight, which looks absolutely beautiful. So we will be doing that. Uh, look at how cool these are. You've got the uh, Mickey hands above the lifts, so anyway, yeah, take you for a proper walk around the ship as well at some point. Where are we going? We're not going, we're going that way. It's like the lady's going to We're going tonight. I like this lift. Oh, this is one where you can see them um, through the glass. Oh, no. I'm going up to his floor. Oh, you even does. Oh, that feels weird. That you hey, look at him. Bye. <laughs> 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 oh. That's adorable. Oh, two nine, two nine. Last one in, no. first one out. Twenty quid, yeah. I said I'm not. Bye, guys. Thank you. Right. Oh, into it this way. We're all doing room service there. Oh, we've got food. Room service there. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> is this a, yeah, this is a oh, You can go in pool if you want. Oh, look at the queue. Do you want to wait? Yeah. Have a cigarette? So the. Uh, Yeah, the restaurant is some guy in the back of the pool, isn't it? You've got, you got pizza. Pizza, pizza, pizza. Yeah, and burgers and chips. Yeah, because then they can't come down here. This is the 18 hour area. And Cove Calf. You've got the bar. You've got the, uh, you know, the two jacuzzis in the swimming pool. For the uh, adults. I don't think it's, it doesn't feel as hot today as it did yesterday. Do you think? Is it because we're moving though? It's nice. It is nice. But this is the type of weather where I tend to burn and still stood there. Matt and his boyfriend are still stood there. I did those guys uh, on to Instagram. So yeah. Um, as some of you may have seen or know, um, we are smokers. For people that do come onto the ship, there is a smoking area just located to the port side of the ship at the front. Uh, on the left hand side, just walk past the Cove Calf down to the front. Um, I did hear that there was another one, but I haven't gone searching, to be fair. But it's fantastic down here because you get this amazing view of the uh, front of the ship. And the flag's gone down at the front of the ship, actually. So yeah, and you can get up to a 10, just here as well, on the stairs. Which makes you go onto that balcony just here. Um, and you can see right out to the front, which you've probably seen in a previous vlog. And if you haven't, go check back on my previous vlogs. The guys are getting ready to set up for the uh, show. And they're pulling the floor. Closing the pool up. With this uh, mechanical machine. I think that's pretty cool. So then it can be a dance floor then and people can stand on it. And cleared all the entire area. Now they just come and got me some of the Beautiful chocolate ice cream that's on board, that's free. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> that's really cool. Do one side. She's going to go get me some ice cream. It's really, really nice. So I suppose that's one half of it, and then they'll do the other half, and it joins in the middle. And the guy in green's responsible to make sure that it's done safely and correct. Oh, 
can't tell. Phone table for me, isn't it? Not the pulling the, the floor post. In the middle. So I've come up to a temp deck and there's nobody up here at all and what a beautiful evening it's turning out to be. Look at that view. See Ireland over there on the right in the distance and literally got a cast member sat down there, got some beds, it's just glorious. Got a little ship out there to the left. We uh, crossed another cruise liner this afternoon in the distance. Uh, there's a boat there on the horizon. So, uh, some people have decided to come up now. So it's been great. Um, me and Elle's just eaten. Uh, Lucy did as well. Lucy got a hot dog and chips. I got a burger and chips, Ellie got two slices of pizza and then she also got, um, she got a burger and chips as well. And then Ellie introduced me to the ice cream, uh, properly the chocolate ice cream on here is to die for. Um, like I say, all that food's inclusive, um, pretty much all the food on board is inclusive, uh, inclusive except for Palos um, and if you're drinking obviously like alcohol and stuff, so there's a charge. Um, anybody that smokes, um, just to let you know, yes, you can buy cigarettes on board. Um, if you go into the Cove Caf um, and just ask the, the cast member behind the bar, they will be happy to help you. I know a few people on deck have been asking or saying that there hasn't been cigarettes being sold, but there is, so there is that. So yeah, anyway, we are just chilling out for the afternoon. I think I might go downstairs and have a quick nap um, as 20 past eight this evening. I'm going to be going to Rapunzel's for dinner and I would like to eat tonight as I didn't last night because I was so tired. Um, I think I had about three, four hours sleep last night. I mean, look at this view. We couldn't have asked for better weather, to be fair. It's just, it's just absolutely glorious. So yeah, just to the side of us here, we've got um, a tanker just going past. But there's literally hardly any boats out here at all. I think um, a lot of companies are reluctant to uh, do any type of Any type of work at sea because of obviously COVID. I don't know. Um, I don't know how busy the Irish Sea usually is because I've never been on it. This is the first time, but it's absolutely beautiful. The sea is absolutely calm. So yeah. Anyway, um, what we do is go downstairs, uh, talk to the girls and stuff. And then next time you see me, we'll probably be heading down to Rapunzel's. So um, we'll see you soon, guys. If you're new to the channel, you know what to do. Head on over to Disney D Vlogs. Hit that subscribe button and notification bell to stay up to date with all the latest in Disney news and other tidbits. And you'll be sure to catch us on our next adventure. See you soon, guys.